Clearly in this specific case, it is an active case and we are waiting for it to uh, be fully uh, seen to the end and it would be wrong of anyone to make any comment on this, actually particularly because we are talking about a case of a minor, a protected person. Uh, I think people need to be a little bit careful with their kind of wild speculation uh, on an active case. There's the immediate case and the immediate appeal, and then there's the long-term case on its merits, which also needs to be heard. But absolutely what is clear, and this is why, obviously, through ITA we are taking the action that we are, is that we want to expedite this as quickly as possible. Uh, it's a legal issue, and legal issues, unfortunately, can be very, very complicated. But for all those concerned, not just the, 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 the Russian athlete, but obviously all the athletes concerned in the previous competition, we all need to see as quickly as we can a resolution of this, and we are working as fast as we can uh, under the circumstances to get that. Such cases are not helpful to the Games. I think hopefully most people see that of the, the 3,000 people uh, competing here, there are some wonderful sports, some great sport, and hopefully we can continue to concentrate on that. But you'll also appreciate that we need to the, these cases need to be prosecuted properly, taken care of properly, and due process needs to be, go, needs to be gone through. Uh, otherwise, I think the confidence of people would be even less. So I think it's very important for everybody concerned, not least uh, the 15-year-old uh, athlete that's concerned, that we have due process, that it's seen to be done properly, and that people can have confidence in the, in the decisions that are taken.